Okay, try this again. Over here at 243 Gallagher. Oh, that's that furnace AC change out. Uh, installation guides are inside. It's a 60 amp breaker. And this condenser, for whatever reason, 60. Some are 60, some are 50, but this one's a 60. Got the locking caps. Reuse the old connection, so. There's the insulation guides. Uh, carbon oxide smoke detector over there. Uh, the small ones, the intake, obviously that can be level, but the exhaust, I've got the fall coming back. I only had to redo it right there is all I had to redo it just to come around so we could redo the intake like we always do. Uh, this is the 96 percenter. Um, I'm using an acid neutralizer. It is filled with water. You can see the discoloration back there, but it's never been used, so it's not dirty. But uh, using that as our P-trap like we always do. There's our connection. Drain for the AC coming over into here. Um, we put a pan, even though we don't need it. Uh, I'm gonna put a hole. I'm just gonna put a hole in the corner. It's got so much fall in this concrete. You can see how I raised it that the pan would have to fill up almost all the way to get it out of the get it out of there but um, it was because the old um, humidifier was leaking all the time and so that's why we did that but anyway everything sealed up um, electrical um, I, I mean I didn't change that this was already done um, I just remounted it onto here the line coming in it's all secure gas line secure uh, new gas flex line uh, settlement trap not very big um, got to another one there and then it's sitting right on it's sitting right on that wood uh, so and then of course it's connected right there. <sighs> anyway, uh, it's direct vent, so I didn't mess with the water heater. And I think that's it. Need me to do anything or if I forgot something, just let me know guys. Thanks.